first. Until you really get used to it, eventually it'll become like old habit. Right? So find your grip first and then raise your finger. So, cause you need to find out where to put it on here, right? That's all, yeah. Okay, now, did you find it a bit odd? Yeah. It? yeah, you will. So you did pretty good considering it's a new grip for you, yeah. All right, so what do you think the purpose of a serve is? Uh, to keep your opponent from getting to the net. Okay, right. So that means that every serve should be deep, as deep as far back as possible, right? So let's say that I was, uh, well, give me a couple serves first. Let's start with that. Let me see how you do this. This feels really strange. Okay. Try it. So first of all, you're putting on your waist, which is a no-no, all right? You have to make sure in pickleball, it has to be below your waist when you make contact, all right? So you want to, most people who want to have really good control of their ball are not going to let it release until the paddle gets to it. And you're releasing your ball in the air and then hitting. So I'm going to show you a different way to serve, okay? And I think you'll be fine with that. Okay, so if I was lined up perfectly straight, I would be lined up, my body would be like this. So this is my waist right here, mm -hmm. okay? But because I want to go diagonal, I want to line my body up still straight, not turned. But I'm diagonally straight. Do you understand what I mean by that as opposed to this? So I'm doing this, all right? Uh -huh. So after I've got my body lined up like that, I'm going to take my left foot and I'm going to put it forward, okay? Now, when I go to hit the ball, I'm going to show you how I'm going to hit it, and then I'm going to show you how I really hit it, okay? But just okay. because there's another step to it. So if you line your body up, your ball will stay in the court. It's not going to go to the court if you make sure that your paddle is in line with your foot. All right? So when you hit the ball, I'm looking at nothing but the ball and paddle. It's going to stay in the court every time. Okay? Perfect serve. So, forward, it's going to stay in the court every time. I'm not looking at the court at all because I've lined my body up appropriately now. When I really serve, I step in. So I always stand back, but I do exactly the same thing. I'm lined up, my foot's forward, and I go to serve and I step. All right? Now what did I change there? I didn't do anything different, but I stepped. I stepped. Okay. So when I swing, I step. Let's see. Right? Mm -hmm. And so I don't release my ball until the paddle hits it. And I have my head down. I've got my body lined up. I'll stay still this time. And all I'm doing is swinging my paddle in line with that foot. Whoops, sorry. Yeah. I'm still talking. <laughs> all right? So it should stay in the court every single time if you line your body up to do that. Okay? Also, when you go to serve, you'll notice when I serve, where, look where my paddle ends up. Look where it is. Mm -hmm. It comes up all the way. Right? Try it. We've got a couple of balls. Now, so you've got your body turned the wrong way. So you want your body this way, this way, like that. Now step forward with your left foot. Now when you swing your paddle and your ball, your ball is down here. So squat down a bit. Your ball is here. And you want to get under that ball, okay? So that's the direction you're going. You're already lined up. So see how your foot is? Mm -hmm. That's how you want your paddle to go. Okay, so parallel. That's right. Okay, so that was not bad. You came across just a little bit, yeah. all right, when you hit it. So you want to make sure you're going forward. So what you're basically doing is you're hitting the ball as if you're hitting it with the palm of your hand, and you're going in line with that foot. And also what you're doing is um, you want to think about showing the face of the paddle to your opponent. If you think about that, it'll get you in the right position. 